You know, one of the most popular shows uh, this season is Head of the Class. Yeah. Have you seen it? Oh, well, sure. Yeah. Oh, of course. Here's a scene. Watch. What do we have that Eric wants? <laughs> oh, no. Uh-uh. I mean, that's outrageous to even think that I'd consider... Simone, we just want you to ask him. Oh. <laughs> With everything you've got. I don't know. It looks Fun. like a hair commercial, doesn't <laughs> it's it? It's amazing. Heads of hair. Kimberly Russell plays Sarah Nevins on Head of the Class, and uh, today she's here with a spring and summer look at the fashions the teens will be wearing on and off the screen. Please welcome Kimberly Russell. Thank you. Thank you. Everybody's got long, long yeah, hair. Is that by design? Did you all get together and decide to have long hair? Actually, we didn't. When we started out, we were all at different lengths, but now we're all kind of even. So we're going to have to get together. We're on hiatus right now and decide who's going to have what look. Who gets cut? That's right. Who gets cut? <laughs> who gets cut? Yeah. Now, your role as Sarah kind of parallels uh, your own life, doesn't it, in a sense? Is your mom a teacher? Yeah, my mom's a teacher, and she teaches uh, gifted children, children that are smart. Like oh. geniuses, yeah. Yeah. Oh, how yeah. wonderful. And yeah. here I am, playing a genius. <laughs> <laughs> uh, in terms of getting the part, was that difficult? Uh, I auditioned back in March. My story's kind of one of those Hollywood stories that you don't hear very much. And the producer, Michael Elias, said to me, you've got the part, you're perfect for it. And I didn't hear anything for uh, like three or four months later. Yeah. Then I got a phone call six days before I started the show saying, come on out. And oh. in the show, they were so impressed. You must have been driving your agent crazy. No, I wasn't. Really? I sat there tight because he convinced me so much when he said, you're right for the part. I was pretty... I took him for his word. Well, that ought to restore faith Good in Hollywood. Good for you. Well, huh? yeah, now, right. One of the fun parts of the show is the wardrobe. Oh, absolutely. Because you kids really wear now stuff. Yeah, <laughs> I'm upstairs in our wardrobe department every week looking, what did I get to wear this week? Uh -huh. Just so Love exciting. Yeah. And yeah. tell yeah. us a little bit about okay. what we're going to see today. Well, today we're going to see uh, things from Jabot and Jockey and, like, fun things... The thing about young people now is that clothing and color, it's almost like melody. And I think that youth now, they like to create music with what they're wearing. It's like almost a statement I'm making. Look at me. Yeah. That's fun and funky. And that's what we're going to see today. A All lot right, of fun well, stuff. All right, well, let's listen Terrific. to some of this okay. fashion. All right, here we go. <laughs> this is Cindy, and she's sporting Jabot's side button skirt. And button side, and the, uh, it turns into skirt. Oh, yeah. Okay, and... The t-shirt is Jabot's collection of Paris print, and the jacket's also light enough for summer. More than all summer long. Isn't that great? Well, it does sing, doesn't it, huh? <laughs> <laughs> and another thing, like I said before, that color is melody. Nothing really matches now. Like yeah, you wouldn't I noticed wear, that. Yeah, so she's got like a tint of green and blue, and then the darker jacket. She yeah. looks great. Now, I've spent terrific. most of my life not matching, and just when I get to a point where I match, now it's out of vogue. All right. Not... Thank you, Stanley, very much. Okay, next. Here we have David. And David uh, looks great in anything he wears, but this is a, this is called a variegated striped coat. Hey. Isn't that, look at these muscles on this guy. Oh, wow. oh, now you gotta get with it. Well, he <laughs> needs, a, and, needs some wheat hanging out of his mouth yes, or something. <laughs> huh? This is called a, the bib overall. This is very in fashion now, this look. <laughs> Now, these are stonewashed jeans. This took five hours to create this look. Five hours of work went into that. What do you mean? Well, no, wait, what do you mean? And this is streak chic. Five hours of this stonewashed. To get those well, what do you mean stonewashed? Like what do you do? They took them, and I think they literally beat them against the stone and, and uh, faded the, the denim that way. Ah. It took five hours. Yeah. Well, he, Isn't he that great? Take the stone and beat the pants, I suppose. <laughs> yeah. That's great. What an interesting look. Yeah. Unpredictable. Very, very interesting. Thank you. All right, Kimberly, what's next? Okay, next we're going to have Cindy. Boy, that Here's was sweet. Yeah. With this, <laughs> this, this outfit is by Kit Kits, and it's uh, natural lightweight cotton. That looks great. Oh, and I like that. The thing I like best is her tennis shoes, her tennies. I call oh, them tennies yeah, the here. Tennies, yeah. tennies here in L.A. Oh, I think that's a smash. That part. looks terrific, right. Cindy. That'd be great at the yeah. beach. Yeah. At the club, whatever. And it, this looks so cool, and when you're in things like this, you feel you feel cool. So yeah. these are great for summer, these kind of stripes. Good stuff. Oh, yeah. that's just terrific. Thank you, Cindy. Thank very you, much. Cindy. Okay. And here's himself. Here's David. Hey. David, where are your shoes? Oh, <laughs> this is called a window pane jacket. 
And underneath it, he's got on a red tank top. That's great. That's a show. Certainly does. <laughs> and this is a super wearable oh, outfit. Down, Lee. For summer. <laughs> that looks fun. good. I'll huh? squid on you. Yeah, it looks terrific. Well, and now, now they David, can what? trade off. He can wear her shirt and she can wear his jacket. And they're they're off and having fun. The tennies won't fit though. Will no, they, they won't. <laughs> no. Are you into sports? Yeah, wait with me. Wait with me, obviously, yeah. <laughs> but no football or anything like that. I used to. No, no. Yeah. Well, it's nice having you both with us today. This has been terrific. Thanks, Thanks Kimberly. Yeah. Good luck. We'll take a short pause and be right back. We're back with our woman of the hour, Lee Remick, and one of the stars that headed the class, Kimberly Russell. And we've had an exciting fashion show. That we got some great. more? Yeah. Yes, we do. We've got two more. We're going to have Cindy out here in a poplin duster coat. Isn't this pretty? Oh, that's yeah. nice. Okay. And this can be worn all summer long. Now, this can be worn as a dress. She can put leggings under that like she's got on now and uh -huh. a pair of shoes and dress that up. And this is super comfortable. Now, notice that the coat is cut shorter in the back. Yeah, I see. See that? That's yeah. just to add a little slice of fun there. Cindy, you look great in that color. <laughs> Terrific. That's color. wonderful. Yeah. Good. Okay, that's very that's nice. That's also by Jabot. And now, Jabot, they, they give clothes to head of the class and Cosby oh, show. Yeah, a lot of ah. young people on TV yeah. are wearing oh, their Hey, David. look at this. Yep. Okay, now David is wearing, this is a zip neck. He can wear that frontwards or backwards. And this is a safari short, lightweight poplin duster coat, another duster coat. These are very in. And he can dress this up in the summer. He can wear this out at night under a black shirt, black pants. Yeah. And he's got on his culottes there. Culottes are really in, and you look great in them, David. <laughs> <laughs> you get a lot of response from, from the show and the fashion? Yeah. Yeah, yeah we do. Well, yeah. it's been a thrill to have you. Thank you, Kimberly, very, very much. Before we go, what? I just... 20 years too late. Oh my gosh. Your cup I of got sugar, my cup of sugar. <laughs> ah, that's funny. Thank you, Lee. Thank you. Come back and see us. This has really to. been terrific. Thank you. My pleasure. All right. Thank you. Now, join us tomorrow. We're going to find out how aging affects a man's sexuality. Arnie Becker's secretary on L.A. Law, Roxanne Melman, Suzanne Rutan, is going to be guest chef in the Our Kitchen. We'll meet the young actor who starred in the hit movie Stand By Me, Will Wheaton. And our woman of the hour is going to be Barbara Edens. Until then, Gary Collins reminding you, try to make every hour count. Have a nice day and evening. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. The paper made metal roller...